So one of my favorite features in Final Cut Pro 10 is the copy and paste attributes function. And in Final Cut Pro 10.3, there's been a great upgrade um, to this. So if we grab a clip here, for instance, and then add a simple reframing of our image by using the crop function here. So crop and then select crop in the middle. We can reframe this shot. And what we can do once we've pressed done here is we can copy and paste that attribute to these other image clips as well. So if I select this clip, I can go to edit, copy, select two or more clips. And this becomes really useful when you're pasting it onto a large number of clips. We can go to edit, paste attributes. And now in Final Cut Pro 10.3, we have the attributes that are associated with this clip already selected. So we can choose much more easily which attributes we want to paste. So I'm going to click paste for those attributes. And then if we scrub along the timeline here, you can see we've changed the crop, the framing of those other shots. Now, one thing that wasn't available in previous versions of Final Cut Pro is the ability to remove those attributes, which is now available in Final Cut Pro 10.3. So if I highlight these three clips and I go to edit, you can see now we have the remove effects and remove attributes functions here. So if we press remove attributes, we're going to get a choice of the attributes that we want to remove. So we can be really specific about the different attributes that we want to remove. So if I hit remove here, we'll remove those attributes. I'm going to take a step back here for a second and just add those attributes back on um, by going to edit and undo. And now I'm going to come across to my effects here and I'm just going to throw um, a few quick effects onto my clips here. So I'm going to grab my focus on here and we'll just change the the center point of this okay and then i'm gonna add another effect here so we'll go for color we'll add a sepia tone to this clip okay so you can see we've got this kind of nice effect on our clip and so we're going to go to edit copy select these other two clips which at the moment have no effects on them and we're going to go to edit paste attributes and we're going to get a choice of which effects we want to paste so we're going to add everything onto there so now we have this focus option here and we can come in and we can adjust uh, the position of that by highlighting the effect up in the effects panel here. So we can move this down or we could move this up here even better. So we're focused on this point on the horizon and then we can do the same for our better muscles here and we can move our focus point down right to the, the middle of this shot. So we've got other options in here, but what I'm interested in now is that we can select all those clips and go to edit and remove effects. So now that's taken all those effects off of those clips. I'm just going to do Command Z. So you can see I've gone from having effects on each of these clips to highlighting them all. And I can either use Remove Effects, which removes absolutely everything, takes it back to square one, or I can highlight Edit, Remove Attributes, and it's going to give me a choice of which effects and which attributes I want to change. So we've got some great control over there in the way that we can copy and paste effects. And this will work for audio adjustments too. So I have a clip here, just zoom out, um, where I've added um, some gain. So in my options up here, I have some parameters for the gain. And I'm going to push this up to 16. And I can now copy that. And then using the shortcut Shift, Command and V, I can paste my attributes onto the other clip and you can see I'm getting a couple of things here. I'm getting a crop, which I've done on this clip, which I don't want to copy across and the gain effect. So I can choose which ones I want to paste. This is a really exciting updated feature in Final Cut Pro 10.3. This ability to copy and paste attributes as we could before, but also now this ability to modify and remove those attributes en masse on a number of different clips.